Angun al Teatro Sistina per Jesus Christ Superstar e quindi innanzitutto volevo chiederti eh, prima di eh, partecipare a questo, a questo musical eh, conoscevi il Teatro Sistina che è forse il teatro più importante in Italia no? da questo punto di vista? Before coming here I honestly did not know about Sistina, about Teatro Sistina but then I walked i walked here, I walked inside, I see these walls and I see these seats and I, I went uh, up on stage and I could somehow feel there's a lot of history in this place and I felt uh, a bit, you know, emotional when this really touches me when, um, when I came here the first time and then uh, and then of course i mean uh, uh, a place like this is um when it's so significantly um uh taking o over you somehow it can only be important and then they told me that yeah this is this is teatro sistina of course uh, you are in the place in the theater for musical so i'm very happy tra l'altro questo non è il tuo primo musical, no? tu sei una star internazionale, eh, però in questi appunto ultimi anni ti sei, ti sei cimentato. E quindi eh, quando ti è arrivata questa proposta, qual è stata la tua, la tua reazione? Perché effettivamente il musical è conosciuto in tutto il mondo. Eh, il ruolo è molto particolare perché quello di Maria Maddalena insomma, non è proprio mente, no? eh, un ruolo tra i più, tra i più classici che, che ci possano essere. Quindi innanzitutto qual è stata la tua reazione e che cosa ti ha, ti ha convinto ad accettare? Yeah, so my experience in musical is very little. I've, before Jesus Christ Superstar, I've only played in one musical last year. So when uh, my manager told me that uh, there's Jesus Christ Superstar in Italy, <laughs> I said yes, because of course, Jesus Christ Superstar is one of the most iconic um, musical in the world. And, uh, and I was extremely happy and very honored that they offered me this role of Madalena. And because, again, uh, there are a lot of beautiful artists that have played Madalenas. Um, I can think of um, uh, Sarah Bareilles in America. There's Melanie Chisholm, you know, from the Spice Girls. And, uh, and of course, the uh, inimitable uh, Yvonne, um, Yvonne Elliman. And, uh, and for me to, uh, to be able to play her in 2024, it's, uh, it's a beautiful gift. Tra l'altro, in scena ritrovi Lorenzo Licitra con cui hai già duettato, no? eh, quindi come è stato ritrovarvi e, e tra l'altro appunto eh, il fatto che Ted invece, l'iconico Ted, eh, sia stato, eh, sia presente diciamo, come supporto ma non sul palco ti dispiace più, un pochino ti dispiace magari senza togliere nulla ovviamente a Licitra ma eh, se avessi potuto avresti voluto farlo con lui ovviamente <laughs> well actually meeting uh, uh, being on stage now with uh, with Lorenzo after doing a duet and we also did a, um, uh, a show together okay. in, in Indonesia uh, a few years back and uh, it was more classical okay. show and so I'm really really happy because I love him he's such a good singer And he, and he makes a very handsome Jesus and he actually looks like Jesus so uh, and then meeting Ted it's like meeting a piece of history <laughs> it's like Ted Neely I mean he is iconic you know but um, I I have to say he's you know he's passing the torch to uh, Lorenzo and uh, he's almost like the godfather <laughs> <laughs> it's it's really touching this moment and um no I don't feel sorry at all for not playing Madalena with uh, with him but um because I uh, because you know he it's, it's it's for me when there is Ted Neely Madalena is Yvonne You know. E poi non posso non chiederti, eh, tu essendo musulmana, come vivi questo, questo fatto appunto di, di interpretare invece un'icona del, del cristianesimo? Well, I have to say that even though I'm a Muslim, I, I went to Catholic school uh, for 12 years in Indonesia. So I have, I have had a very, uh, you know, wide um, 
uh, I, uh, how can I put it? Um, my parents taught me about tolerance and that religion is something very personal, is between you and God, and this is a rock opera. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's it has nothing to do for me but um but i see that um of course this is this is something important for a lot of people but uh again the fact that i am a muslim and 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 this is like a message probably the way people you know i don't, I don't know how people would un- will would see it but i guess it's a message of tolerance that someone like me from this background would play this kind of um, uh, character and uh, I have to say I'm not new into the Christianism because I sang in front of uh, Jean-Paul II, uh, the Pope Benedictus and Pope Franciscus. (laughs) So I sang for three popes and then now I play uh, Madalena. So it's uh, again it's an honor and it doesn't have anything to do with religion. It's about um, music and uh, if it can give message of tolerance to other people, then yes, I do it gladly. Perfect. E quindi diamo, diamo l'appuntamento per il Teatro Sistina. So, um, so come to the Teatro Sistina for Jesus Christ Superstar starting tomorrow, March 20th, and all the way until April 7th. See you there. Grazie, complimenti. Grazie.